Welcome back to Tired Old Queen at the Movies. Uh, I want to thank all of our subscribers, and we really want to thank Joe My God, Kenneth in the 212, Chaos Theory, and Hunk Du Jour. Without you guys, we would not have this many subscribers. If you guys haven't checked out those channels, please do. And now it's time to go see the Tired Old Queen at the Movies. Hi, Johnny. Tired Old Queen at the Movies. <laughs> Johnny, I wanted to recommend a summer love story for you, and I chose Picnic, directed by Josh Logan, starring William Holden, Kim Novak, and Rosalind Russell from 1955. Josh Logan had directed the original Broadway company of this. It was based on a Pulitzer Prize-winning play by William Inge about a group of Midwestern women whose lives are changed over the course of a Labor Day weekend when a strange drifter comes into town who's very charismatic and sexy. And Broadway was played by Ralph Meeker and it was around the same time as the method and Brando had started coming in. So he was sort of sort of like that. He had a leather jacket and he sort of played it like Brando. But when they went to do the movie, they instead they cast William Holden. Now William was a little long in the tooth for this part, but there was nobody a better actor at that time than William Holden and he does a terrific job. You think just because you act young why you can walk in here and make off with whatever you like. Kim Novak had basically, this was her first first big starring part and she was learning to act as she went along. She was very, very good. She was in her early 20s. She was only 22 a few years later when she made Vertigo. So she does a really, really nice job as the prettiest girl in town who's not necessarily the brightest, but everybody wants to go out with her. She's having a relationship with the richest guy in town played by Cliff Robertson and she's constantly taunted by her bratty little tomboy sister played by Susan Strasberg who was Lee Strasberg's daughter and does a really terrific job. She went from this back to Broadway and played Anne Frank on Broadway in the Diary of Anne Frank. Now, the other key role in this is Rosalind Russell. And Roz Russell plays the school teacher who is sort of frustrated and a spinster and wants to get married. And she, her, her boyfriend is played by Arthur O'Connell who got an Oscar nomination for this part. And they, you watch their courtship back and forth and she keeps trying to get him to propose. I guess I know why you want me to keep on drinking. Early on, they went to her and they said, you know, Roz, you're so good in Picnic that if you let us nominate you as a supporting actress, you're going to win your Oscar finally. And Roz said, nope, if it's not going to be a Best Actress Oscar, I don't want it. And she forfeited it, and the Oscar eventually went to Joe Van Fleet, who played James Dean's mother in East of Eden, a part I love. Anyway, Roz is terrific in this. This movie also has Nick Adams as the cocky little guy. Who are you? What's that matter? I'm bigger than you are. He also did Rebel Without a Cause. He was a good friend of James Dean's. And um, he also uh, it was known in gay circles, uh, especially by Rock Hudson, as being a rather big man on campus. Kid, you better get away from this wall. You're liable to get educated. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This was shot on location in Kansas. It has this gorgeous sensual scene built around this old song called Moon Glow that they intersperse with this beautiful love theme from Picnic. And they do a dance, William Holden and Kim Novak down by the river. That's so sexy and they court each other and they fall in love. It's funny because the morals at that time, you kind of, you're, the audience has wanted her to run away with this stranger. Now you kind of watch the movie and you think to yourself, you know, he's, kind of a bum. He's not going anywhere. She's throwing her life away with the bum. She should go with the rich guy like her mother wants her to, but neither. That's not romantic enough, and that doesn't work, and it doesn't matter. It's romance. It's the 1950s. It's shot in gorgeous color. Betty Field plays the mother. Verna Felton plays the wife, and I'm going to be playing Verna Felton's part in a stage version of Picnic done by the Tweed Theater Company. We're calling it Pickup, and it's going to be done at the Dixon Place Summer Theater Festival on June 29th and 30th of this month. So make sure you come on down and see it. And Johnny, I look forward to seeing you there. And in the meantime, pick up Picnic. It's well worth it. Ooh, so sexy. Hey, Stephen, you've never looked more beautiful. Nuts. The popcorn can't be beat.